Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will cover the lab that is data prep quick start. So first of all, start lab and open cloud console in cognito window. In case you haven't subscribed to the channel, do subscribe it and like the video. Now, wait for this page to open. Now click on I understand. In case it's asked for username and password, always refer to the lab instruction. Click on I agree and then select agree and continue. Now we have to create a storage bucket for task number one. So for that, as you can see, we have to create a storage bucket and you can name it anything. So click on cloud storage. In case it's not visible, just type it cloud storage. So finally the page open. Now click on create bucket. So for the bucket name, as you can see, there is no name. If it asks for the name, always enter the name from lab instruction. But as it's not mentioned, just write any name and make sure to enable all that. As you can see, it's showing error. So write anything extra alphabet. So now click on continue and then click on create. So now as you can see, we have to click on create. And make sure to check the check my progress you will get the score without any issue now for initializing the cloud data prep that is our task number two we need to activate the cloud shell so first of all click on this it will basically activate the cloud shell session now here finally the cloud shell is live we will run this and wait for this command to execute completely So now we will initialize the data prep. So finally it's done. Now minimize it or close the cloud shell here type on the search box data prep. So select the first one. And this task is very easy. I have read all the terms and conditions. And then click on allow. Now here click on again. Click on the checkbox and then click on agree and continue. So now allow. Select your student account and then click on continue. So you may ask to sign in. So you may be asked to sign in. So for that just select your student account and click on continue. And click on allow. Now we will be on redirected on the data prep page. Again, we have to do the same. That is, we will have to accept the conditions and click on accept. So finally, data prep is being initializing. And when we will move forward to the lab instruction and first of all, click on continue. So now it's working. So finally, it's done. Now let's move forward to the lab instruction and hit check my progress for the task. You will get the score without any issue. And in case you face any error, do let me know in the comments. Thank you guys. Do like, share and subscribe to the channel.